I am super excited. I have something brand new to show you. I haven't even played with it yet. So if you go to your text button and type up some text and then click on it, there's a brand new button up here called Warp. If you read this little warning that pops up, it does say that you're going to have to subscribe to Cricut Access if you want to cut anything with the Warp feature. I'm going to just go check it out. So that allows me to preview it. So now instead of just being able to curve text, I can warp it. And let's type in some more text. And you might think that looks like it's just curved, but let's look at if I curve goes along a circle where this warp does more of a rainbow. I don't know. How would you describe that? So you can warp it up. Let's do this. I'm gonna put them over here so you can see them better. So if I warp it up, or no, warp it like a bridge. Warp it that way. You do have to be in Cricut Design Space version 7.29.147 and in the beta version. To get to the beta version, you're going to go under settings and then right here, click beta. What that means is that you're agreeing that if things don't work right and are glitchy, you're okay with it because you're in the beta testing world. So test it out and play around with it. Now that I showed you how to get there, let's look around and see what different designs we can make. So if you look between number two and number four, like they're similar, but not exactly. all about how much of this kind of curve it's got going on. Look, you could do fun things like line them underneath each other or something. There's lots of different options you can play with. So there's 34 different ways you can warp your text. There's all the different ways you can warp text. So play around with that and have some fun. Before you go, make sure to like, subscribe, and comment below. I love to hear from you.